And now live from our studios in sunny Key West, Florida, it's Good Morning with Rick and Jenna. And here are your hosts, Rick Lopez and Jenna Stoffer. Good morning, Florida Keys. Welcome to the show. I'm Rick Lopez, along with Jenna Stopper. Good, Good morning. morning. Good yeah. morning, everyone. Thank you for starting your morning off yeah, with us. Yeah, it's great to have you with us. Another mm -hmm. big show today. How are you this Thursday morning? I'm doing well. Yeah, I'm what's doing well. I'm excited, you? you know, about yeah. these guests today, Rick. Yeah. I love it. We have Jeannie Sealander coming in from the Monroe County Sheriff Sheriff's Animal Farm. That's right. And I love it. Jeannie's always comes fun when she's coming. Now, today, <laughs> she's... She's bringing an alligator with her uh -huh. this morning. Now, would you will you try and hold the no, alligator? Rick, no, Rick, I will not try and hold the alligator. Really? That will be up to you to do. All right. So you, you have no desire to, have no to desire actually to hold, hold the alligator. alligator. I'm All right, sorry, well, I don't know. Well, Jeannie's going to be here. It's always great when she's here. We'll have some fun when she comes in with us uh, today. Also, you know, Jenna, we're not that far away now from the annual World Championship offshore powerboat races. That's right. It's right. going to be here before you know it. Before you know it. And Larry Blyle, he is the president of the Conquer Public Offshore Powerboat Racing Association. He's going to join us uh, today, and he's going to uh, give us get us kind of updated on what's happening over there because it's, you know, it's it's less than a month away. Mm -hmm. And it is a big, come here. a huge event that is filled, you know, all week long. You know, the the powerboat event. races. You know, we're we're coming into a time right now that is really good for us here mm -hmm. in the Keys. Obviously, Goombay and Fantasy Fest right around the corner, and then you go right from that. You know, you get the parrot heads that come down here, but then one of the biggest a huge event it means so much money to the community is the powerboat races i mean they just generate so much for our economy in november and i can't wait and plus to go out and see the boats right you know uh, we should ask Larry if we can get you on a boat. I know. I there. would love to do that. Absolutely. You said yeah. the other day you were yeah. going to ask, so That's don't right. forget. I'm going to try to remember to get you on a boat out there this year because that would be pretty cool. Yeah. You do you do take that. the family down? Each yeah. Year? Oh, yeah. of course. You know, that's one of the great – it's a great family event mm -hmm. down there to go out and, and watch it. And Well, you, you got a chance to go check it out I last did, year. But I wasn't year. here. I was out of town mm -hmm. for some of it, so uh -huh. I didn't really get all of it. Yeah, well, so this year I'll get all of it. Three big days of racing, and Larry Blyle will tell us, all about it when he joins us. Now, well, what's going on with you? Oh, Anything you know, good? not too much. Yeah. The week's winding down already, know, right, Rick? It's, oh, goodness. Do yeah. you have a game? Mm -hmm. You have a game this weekend. I had a game tomorrow night, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, the Conks will be taking on American High School. We're back mm -hmm. at home. Is it homecoming? Tough. When's homecoming? Homecoming is on November 10th. No, okay. Oh, yeah. your homecoming. It's late. It's the last <laughs> game of the year. <laughs> That's how they do it in Florida, huh? Right, yeah. In Indiana and North Carolina, we did it early. Did, did you season. do it early? Usually they, you would do it kind of during the, the middle of the season, but the crazy thing about the conch football season is every game but one has been at home this year. Mm -hmm. So That's they've just, nice. they decided nice. that it would be the final uh, game of the year will be homecoming for Key West. So that's still a couple of weeks away right mm -hmm. now. Conk's mm -hmm. just looking to bounce back and pick up a win after that tough loss at Jackson last week. So. Well, this will be mm -hmm. the week for them to do it. Yeah, it's, uh, let's hope so. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, so I got a game coming up uh, tomorrow night. Anyway, we got a big, we got a fun show for everybody mm -hmm. this morning. Yeah. I love it when Jeannie is here. Yeah, I do yeah. too. She's brought in already two different animals before, but this is the first do you know what? Can you remember what she's brought? No. The, well, the sloth. <laughs> the sloth. I remember the sloth. And, and I, I remember this more than you, and I, I was know. in Africa, and you did the show, the kinkajou. The she had the kinkajou. Yes, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. When Hobie was Those were friendly. <laughs> Those were friendly and, you know, warm and cuddly, so right. we'll see how this alligator. Well, we got an alligator for you here uh, <laughs> this morning. And then Larry Blyle from the Conquer Public Offshore Powerboat Racing Association will join us and get us updated on everything that's getting ready, all the prep and all the hard work that, that's, that goes in to producing the World Championship Offshore Powerboat Races here in Key West. So we got a big show. What That's do you right. say so we get started here? Stay with us, everyone. Here. You're watching. Just getting started. Yes, you're watching. Good morning, Florida Keys, right here on WEYW Channel 19 on UVerse Channel 87 on Comcast. Good morning. Don't go away. We're back after this. Good Morning with Rick and Jenna has been a presentation of WEYW Channel 19 and the Belize Broadcasting Network.